Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you guys are having a great day so far today. But in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys yet another top 5 best modded crew colors you should have in GTA 5 Online. Now if you guys want to check out any of my older modded crew color videos I made, I'll have them all linked at the top of the description if you guys want to go ahead and check those out for yourself. But yeah, now that all that's out the way, let's get straight into today's video. So first of all, I'm going to actually show you guys how to actually switch your crew color. So you guys just want to go right here to socialclub.rockstargames.com. Now you guys can do this on the Xbox like me. Take a look at my Microsoft Edge. Or if you're on PS4, I don't know if you guys have Microsoft Edge. Or you could just do it on a computer or your phone. But yeah, just go to this website, then click Cruise, go to My Cruise. And then what you're going to want to do is go down to your crew that you guys actually own. Make sure you guys actually own it. Then you're going to want to click Edit Crew. Once you click edit crew, come over here up to where it says crew color, click that, and right here where this hashtag symbol is, is where you're going to want to put the codes that I show you guys during this video. So whichever color you guys like, just put that code that I'll provide you guys in the video right there in that section. And then once you guys put that code in, just click save this crew, and once you saved it, restart your GTA 5, load back in, and you guys will have it. Now let's get into the colors. Now for this video, I'm going to be putting all these crew colors on my Coquette D10. I know a lot of you guys wonder what car I'm putting it on. Now, just like always in my modded crew color videos, I'm going to put these colors on the Coquette D10. I think the colors just really pop out that much more on this car. But yeah, let's get into this first color. Now, this first color is going to be like an ocean blue type color. And I'll actually have the code for this crew color at the top of your screen right now. You guys can see the code right there. Just enter that in. But yeah, right now, I'm actually going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how that color looks. It's actually pretty nice. I'm going to go here. Here. All right, now take a look. This is how the color looks. It's very nice, like an ocean blue type color. And just alone by itself, it looks very nice. But obviously, I recommend to put a pearlescent on all these crew colors. Just makes it pop out that much more. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put the... Let's see. I think I'm going to go with the ice white or frost white. Yeah, I'm going to just go ice white. Take a look. With ice white pearlescent, it looks very, very nice. I recommend putting ice white pearlescent on all of the crew colors that you guys get. It just looks that much more uh, good and it pops out more in my opinion. Take a look. This is how it looks like outside. It's very nice. It's not that bright, but it is very nice as well. It's like a light type of blue. I'll show you guys a very uh, brighter version of this color later on in the video. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this first color down below in the comment section. Now let's get into the next color on this list. Now into this next color, you guys can see the name of it. It's Blood Orange, and I'll have the code right there at the top of your screen, just like always. But yeah, here I'm going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how this color looks. It actually looks very nice just by itself. Take a look. It's a very nice Blood Orange. It looks red, but it is Blood Orange. Take a look. It has like accent of orange in there. And yeah, this is how it looks by itself. Like I said, you guys can put this by itself and it'll look nice. But you guys can put whatever you guys want on top of this crew color. I'm going to just go ahead and put a Frost White or Ice White pearlescent. Let's see. I think for this one, I'm going to go... Let's see. I think I'm going to go Frost White, actually. Should I? Yeah, I think I'm going to go Frost White with the Pearlescent instead of Ice White. It just makes it pop that much more in my opinion. So that's why I put them on almost all the crew colors. But you guys can put whatever Pearlescent you guys want to. Whatever you guys think looks best. But yeah, this is the crew color. Let me know what you guys think about this one down below in the comment section down below. Looks very nice, especially with the Pearlescent. The orange pops out just that much more. And yeah, this is the color. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let's go on to the next color on this list. Now here goes the next color. This color looks very nice. It's like an electric blue type of color. Like I said, I was going to show you guys a way brighter version of the first blue. Now here we go. You guys can see the code is at the top of your screen if you guys want to put that in. And this is how it looks. So here it is. You can see it's very much brighter than the other one. It's more of like an electric or I just named it electric blue. But it's really like a glowing blue. I'll show you guys how it looks like outside. But yeah, I put on the crew color like I always do. I'm going to go ahead and put on a frost white or ice white pearlescent. I'm just going to go with ice white probably just so it like goes it like, you know, glows that much more and there we go take a look this is how it looks like outside very very nice i actually like this color a lot it glows a lot like if you guys actually use this in gta 5 online and see it for yourself it glows a lot you guys can see right now very nice color let me know what you guys think about this one down below in the comment section as well but let's go on to the next color on this list now onto the next color this is actually going to be a neon green modded crew color and right now i'm going to show you guys how it actually looks then like always the code is at the top of your screen but yeah right here i'm gonna go ahead and go to the respray and i'm going to show you guys exactly how this crew color looks here we go take a look it's very nice it's like a neon green now it's not as bright as you guys think it is still neon take a look if you put on the white pearlescent it'll like glow that much more but when you take it outside i think i don't know if it's just like how this color is or if it's because it's like getting late but it's not that that uh, glowing. It looks really nice. That's why I still had it on this list. Looks very clean. It's like a neon green type of color. Let me know what you guys think about this down below in the comment section. I feel like this would look good on like a T20. I'm probably going to switch the car up to like a T20. I think T20, T20 is like really good with all type of colors. But let's go on to this next one right here. Now this next color is going to be very nice. It's going to be like a purple type color. And I'm going to show you guys right now how it looks. Now the code is at the top of your screen like always. And here we go right here, respray, primary crew. This is how the color looks. It's very nice, like a light purple. Very, very clean. 
Now I'm gonna go ahead and put a pearlescent like I always do. I'm gonna put probably a ice white or a frost white pearlescent. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go with ice white just because it goes that much more. And this is how the color looks very, very nice. It's actually one of my favorite ones on the list. I never really thought I'd like this one, but it kind of grew on me, honestly. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it outside and show you guys exactly how this car looks outside because the cars look way better when I take them outside in the sun. Now here we go right here outside with the crew color on the car. Let me know what you guys think about it. It's very nice outside. It's like a lavender purple slash pink car. It's very clean. And let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. I actually like this color a lot, like I said before. It kind of grew on me. I didn't really think, I, I didn't really like it at first, but it did look way better when I took it outside and even in certain angles in the sun it looks very very clean but yeah that's all the colors in today's video like I said this is a top 5 modded crew color video but I have made multiple older videos in the past of this topic so if you guys are interested and want to see any of those older videos make sure you guys click the links down below at the top of the description I'll have them all linked there down below if you guys want to check out all the other colors you guys can possibly use on your cars but yeah that basically wraps things up for this video hope you guys did enjoy if you guys did go on to enjoy make sure you guys smash the like subscribe to my channel if you guys are new and if you guys are watching till this point of the video go down below in the comment section and comment down a lot of car emojis it doesn't even matter what car emoji you put put any type of car emoji in the comments that lets me know that you guys watched until the end of the video and it has to do with like the video you know this video is about cars so I might as well go comment something down below that relates to the video so go comment down below any type of car emoji that you guys want that lets me know that you guys watched until the end and I'll go ahead and heart your comment but like I said that is the end of the video and I'll see you guys in the next video peace